Hello everybody, this is Flush Hound, and, well, just make this a bit better, by doing this. I just want to address some things. Of course, I did a recording of this earlier, and there's something that I included, which I'm not going to include here. But I just want to include it here. Well, include let me rephrase it. There's something in the recording that I don't want to include here. First, the abso the fox situation. I didn't know he already admitted to his mistake. I was like, let him own up to his mistakes. So what I said on Twitter was completely uncalled for. 
And I do apologize for that. Second is the beef, the drama that I have with Kai Budwolf. In early 2022, prior to the pandemic, but you know that part will be for my next and final topic. But yeah, in early 2022, I misheard what or misinterpreted what Kai Bloodwolf said. But what drove me to hate my was not the fact that he said he hated non-binary people. And from the time I played with him, And the time the well the time that Tetsu and Neko practically talked to him, even though I couldn't see him because I have him blocked at the time of all this preempted stream, which will be recorded. was after I sent Gi a dragon, G-Y dragon, an invite request, he went to Kai Bloodwolf and said, and this is paraphrased, the person you're talking about sent me an invite request. And I felt that was, well, the nail in the coffin because I thought that Kai abused the LGBTQIA plus tag by stating that He hated non-binary people, and he's not like that. So I am sorry for that misinterpretation. And the last thing I'm sorry for is saying that well it's about the incident of early 2020 and what led up to the incident. So I want to travel back to 2019, late 2019 to be precise. Diffuse Moose said on Twitter that he was going to hold a giveaway, an art giveaway, a YCH giveaway for his Street Fighter mock-up. I believe it was called Fur Fighters. I entered the giveaway 
and one action diffuse news should have taken before what I'm about to say next will be addressed at the end of this apology. So, in early 2020, prior to the COVID-19 pandemic, Diffuse Moose said on Twitter that I was a winner of his giveaway. And I went through the replies and saw that Someone named Chrissa Havener, or whatever name she goes by now, basically said that I forgot to give credit to the creator of the Ref Sheet Base, Zavago. And I was stressed enough as it is. Seeing those replies took me over the edge into deep water because I played the victim card and blamed everybody else for attacking me instead of owning up to the mistake at that time. Two to three years later, after that incident, I am now owning up to the mistakes that I have stated. And I am sorry for all the mistakes I've done. But nobody is perfect. We all make mistakes. It's just the big step of owning up to them. And I just want to say this. I do want to reconnect with the 13th Seahawk, Miru Kitsune, Rave underscore in underscore Dave. I underscore Bloodwolf and many others. But at this time, Tetsuneko, the railway cat, has been one of the only supporters. And she's been working hard as, well, a messenger. Like when I jump into her Twitch chat when she's streaming, and I say like, oh, hello. Like she's having to mute her mic like this. I can remember the keyboard bindings for muting the mic. And talk to me from what the others in the instance 
believe she's not talking, but she's actually talking to me on her stream. And if I were to say, hey, tell the 13th Seahawk this, she would have had to mute her mic to everybody in the instance. Possibly say that she would ask the message along and go to the 13th Seahawk, unmute her mic, and say, A friend told me to tell you they said this. And I don't want her to do that anymore. In fact, She has met me in person in San Francisco, California, when she flew, flew from Manila, the Philippines, to Reno, Nevada, USA, for BLFC, with stops in New York, Los Angeles, San Jose, California, in San Francisco, California. But I just want everybody to basically be friends again, especially with me. Now, I did bring up Diffuse Moose earlier, and Fortis hashtag banned by Flashhound Rama, who never had started in the first place. Diffuse Moose should have verified my entry by DMing me, saying, Hey, bud, I can't accept this entry because there's no credit for this reference sheet. Did you make it? Did you make it from a base template? If Diffuse had personally talked to me in Twitter direct messaging, or through Discord direct messaging, or through Twitch whispers, or any other form of private messaging prior to announcing his winners, then the two to three years of lost friendship wouldn't have happened. And I lost the 13 Seahawk, Raven Dave, Mew, Kits, and Nate as friends because I resurfaced the hashtag banned by Flashhound incident to the 13 Seahawk and he brought it up to Mira Kitsune and Raven Dave. I'm not sure how kind Blood Wolf found out about the incident but he may have forgotten at the time that he was publicly broadcasting to Twitch. And this is just so emotional for me to bring up these incidents and apologize for making them. So 
If you still hate me, even though I've apologized for all the mistakes I've stated, then just don't be friends with me anymore. Don't attack me. But anyway, I'm going to end this, well, irregular stream. And before I do, I am non binary, but I'm just going to say this. Own up to your mistakes. Don't attack people all because they've made mistakes. And if you want to talk to me, you can do so on Twitter at the flashy arena. And if you're not already following, you can click the follow button below. If you have a prime sub active, you can use that on me if you want to. I'm also on Patreon, patreon.com slash flash hound, and I will see you.